hi everyone welcome back welcome to my another video and you can see another playlist which is going to be the part of uh, developing a uh, end-to-end -end application in the next gs13 so recently i talked about SwellKit, okay because uh, SwellKit i covered a lot of content SwellKit server-side rendering and here we are with the next gs13 so I'm, I'm already covering a uber eats core and there i'm building some applications with the the next yes the admin portal and one admin portal with the swell kit so swell kit i have covered the basic fundamentals and how to do the session management uh, data fetching routing api routing and all those basic concepts now i saw that one application i'm going to build in the next js earlier i was aware of version 12 but the release version 13 is in the beta version and it is really nicer when I was just exploring about Next.js and I thought of doing one admin portal end to end in the next GS. Why? I mean, if you talk about the next GS 13 changes, you will really like it. I'm already, I'm already going to cover each and every aspect of next GS 13. How the, what are the changes, right? It's going to have a app directory structure. Same as the Swell kit, like this is a simple uh, next GS 13 project, right? And it, it is the, I mean, the beta version, you can enable those flags and you can see, uh, I'm just using this experimental feature app directory because they have now released this app directory. And inside this, these are like directory structure, directory based routes. So inside app, whatever you're writing that becomes indirectly the routes. So they have introduced and enhanced the layouts and react server side components. And they have introduced the turbo pack alpha. I mean, I will say this is like a build system, which is uh, 700 times faster now. I mean, it is doing build in the 1.5 second. I heard about it. They have the stable next image version. So whatever the image you are loading on the page is now faster, next font, next image. These are the new packages they have introduced. They have improved, improvised next link package. So these are the pink packages for uh, navigation, for rendering the fonts, for rendering the the images and this app directory structure which is in the beta beta version it's really a great file system automatic router because what you are doing you are just creating the folder structure that indirectly becomes the router this concept i was like very much impressed in the swell kit also swell kit also does the same thing it creates a folder inside folder you are creating plus page dot ts plus page dot swell plus page dot server dot ts same kind of structure you are going to see in our next JS, you can see here the block will become a, a independent route and then you can define the pages the layout for the login it becomes the pages the component the layout and then you can define the, the data fetching mechanism and all these concepts so i mean we are going to talk about i already covered uh swell kit i'm still covering the videos because swell kit is not only about just going through the concept I'm going to build a whole application. Similarly, I'm now covering this next GS13. And the next GS is all about the, the new features, building the end-to-end -end application with the next GS13. Why I'm covering all these things parallelly to Uber Eats clone? Because I need to build two admin portal. And I thought of using the these latest and the, the greatest technologies. So I can also teach and you guys can uh, build these application end-to-end. -end. Already, I'm already building some microservices, just only the front-end part which is also a server side rendering rendering uh, which is the admin portal for the system users and the admin portal for the restaurant uh, user this is the restaurant dashboard this is using a uh, simple react and i have one swell kit application this is a uh, swell kit i mean you you might have you can you can go through my swell kit content and this is what we are going to do in the next js okay so there are a lot of things to explore uh, about uh, swell kit 13 this is in the still in the beta version but i wanted to explore it in a couple of months this is going to be in the the release version and people will start using it so let's be first exploring the concept and build the application end to end with the next js okay thanks everyone so throughout this playlist i will talk about the next js and then uh, we'll jump on to building an application using next 13.